Howdy. It's your boy, William Sibley. To motivate, to inspire, to entertain, and to drive to pick my daughter up. One daughter at a time. Listen, I have a new story idea I came up with, and I had it documented now so I can prove it down the road that it came from my head. But today is uh, May 30th, uh, 2026. 2018. Watch your attitude. The reason I say that is because my biggest thing in life that has always held me back from fulfilling my purpose, my calling, my real lifelong calling hasn't been to be a salesman, even though that's what I do now. It's to be a motivating, inspirator, entertaining guy using the spoken word, the written word, and videos, and eventually a book and a movie. But right now, my biggest thing that's held me back from achieving all that, and maybe you can relate to this if you're a human being like me and not from another planet, like in some fantasy world, then you can understand what I'm talking about. Actually, knowing you have a calling in your life and knowing the only way for you to have that calling and to taste it and to touch it and to smell it and to lick it because you've done it so many times before in your dream, in your head. Now's the time. So, my biggest thing that's held me back is not anyone else, not any other circumstance, not any whatever any might be in your life or my life is me, William, William. I've held myself back. But no longer. I started on this journey a few months back. Actually pursuing in my heart and in my life like never before what I know my calling to be. And I'm on this journey with you. Not just me, myself, and I, but you. And as I drive to pick up my daughter, who had a final today in science, and I'm hoping that she's happy, because I told her no matter what she gets, it doesn't matter, I still will accept and love her, period. Anyway, what I'm getting at is right this second, right now in real time. It's, uh, what time is it? Just so you know, this is real life. It's 2.42 p.m. And it's May 30th, 2018. And I just want to share what I am no longer going to do with my purpose. I am no longer going to be chicken. I refuse to let this bird hold me back any longer. I refuse to not, not only pursue it, not only say if, but now when it is happening today, not only for me, but for you. And one of the motivating factors that I do this for is for you, whoever you are. Whether you are a person who's just recently started to pursue your lifelong dream, whether you're nine or 109, it doesn't matter. Or you're one of the best in the entire world or one of the icons of the industry, or a regular everyday person like me. We will no longer be chicken. 
And the story idea that I'm going to be working on right now is about how this chicken will no longer hold us back. We will not allow ourselves, the chicken inside of us, to hold us back. My goal is to create a community of like-minded people. Who can support and walk with each other on this journey of success? Because I don't care what you want to be. No matter what it is, on the list of A to Z, whatever that may be, that purpose, that dream that you're called to, I 1000 believe that you will have it. And if you already have it, and if you're already helping other people, like myself, I appreciate what you guys do. Because the reason I'm here now is because all those great motivational, inspirational speakers from Tony Robbins to uh, Mel Robbins to Jim Dyer to uh, uh, Jim Rowan, Wayne Dyer, any person that you can think of, woman or man, who's given the same advice. Just do it. Stop talking about it and just do it. Do it. Do it, do it, do it. Don't let <laughs> this guy hold you back. Okay? My story idea is about chickens that invade planet Earth. And they actually come to a guy who looks like me and they think I'm the leader. But when they find out I'm not the leader, all <laughs> chicken breaks loose. Because there's millions of them coming. Not just one, but millions of them. And we will battle against these chickens with a hero, a superhero. My alter ego, Banana Man. That's right. Banana Man will battle. <laughs> The outer space chicken who's come to take over us. Whatever you do, keep this between us because I kind of want to keep this low key, if you know what I mean. So if you see this and if you know someone you can share it with, that you can trust that they're not going to like reveal the secret stuff about the chickens and Banana Man, let me know. Let me know, but don't tell them. So you go ahead and tell them, it doesn't matter. But tell them, share. Let them know that William Sibley, 1,000%, says that you can do it. And if William Sibley says you can do it, you know what that means? That means that you can do it. We won't let these chickens hold us back. In fact, I'm going to be finding homes for these chickens. Because we're going to convert them. We're going to show them that they cannot control us any longer. Anyway, I think my daughter's about ready to call or walking up or something. So I just want to say thank you very mo Thank you very uh, moment. Thank you very uh, much for giving me this moment of your time. It means a lot to me. And remember, let's support each other and believe in our individual dreams. And let's be a motivating, entertaining influence. Let's help inspire others. Because it's what we're called to do. To be a blessing. To take everything that we have and been given inside of us and actually make it the best that we possibly can with the resources that we've been given and bless others. That's what it's all about. Anyway, check this out. See that? She's calling. I'll do this live because it's not really live yet, but it's kind of live. Yeah, hello? Yeah, hello? Yeah, yeah who's this? Me, me who? What's the password? 
Your daughter. I got two daughters. Uh huh. What daughter? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, daughter oh, two. God. Daughter two four oh six. This is Dad seven two nine seven. I'm here at the secret location, ready to pick you up. Where you dropped me off? Where I dropped you off? Hello. Yeah, in the secret location that I dropped you off at. Ten four, Roger. Okay. Yeah, don't okay. don't forget don't forget <laughs> to bring your chicken. Okay, I love I, I love you. I'll see you when you get here. Bye. Anyway, if you're a parent, if you're a parent like me, help your kids. Don't let this chicken hold them back either. All right? Thanks for listening. It's your boy, William Sibley, to motivate, to inspire, to entertain. And my one word is chicken. Wait, 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 wait. My one word is purpose. Purpose. No, wait, 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 wait. My one word is chicken. Purpose combined into one word, compound word. Thanks for watching, and give me a motivational kiss. In some countries, that's kosher, but you know, come on, dude. It, bye.